Good evening everyone, time for another Bitcoin report. Well I just wanted to give a shout out to the guys that run Bitcoin Rigs because they actually made it really easy on me. I wanted to update you and show you what I found and first of all let me connect and see if my VNC is working. You can see I've got a continuous ping set on the box that I got running and it's kind of spotty as far as latency spikes so I'm not really sure what's causing that whether it's the processor I think it's the processor probably but anyway I do have the VNC working and you can see I'm running this 328 here this for some reason this thing slows down a little bit when I get in here but generally these two cards have been running at 360 to 362 so as soon as I end this session, that one's going to speed up. You can see there's a little differential in the temperature. One's running at 75, the other's running at 60. I looked at them, and it has to do with the placement in the box. One is sitting above the power supply. The other one has more room. So I'm not really sure how high these temperatures are as far as what's too high. I've done a little bit of research and they say that if you go above 80 you've got a problem. So it looks like I'm good but I may have to look at alternate forms of cooling. Uh, I wanted to... oh well back behind here you can see I got my estimated rewards so let's do a quick reset on that and it's a little laggy because of the because of the VNC but we'll do a quick reset on this and see where I'm at. I've only been going about maybe a little over an hour so you can see I've got it's gonna refresh here in a second it's got 0.012 this this point oh one okay so I've generated two bit cents in the last 24 hours so you can see that's there and that that one cent up there the confirmed rewards that was actually about eight days that I ran my CPU on and off so obviously that's quite a bit better so I wanted to jump out and show you what I did to get this working and it was kinda stupid when I figured it out but what I noticed when I looked at the target shortcut that was on my desktop to launch the Phoenix Miner I noticed that it is just launching a file called mine.sh I think it was so I grabbed this file and sure enough this was the one so this is actually to the credit of the guys at the Bit Bitcoin rigs had already written this and really all I needed to do was go in here and plug in the web address of BTC Guild and then put a password in here put a password in here I just altered the file saved it and then boom I rebooted and tested it and it fired up and you have to wait for the Bitcoin client. That was another thing I didn't realize. I know it's kind of stupid, but your Bitcoin client has to be running. So it fires up the Bitcoin client, it fires up the Phoenix miner, and it fires up the the temperature gauge as well. So those are all up and running, and I'm generating Bitcoins. I've generated two bit cents in the hour, I guess at that rate that would give me in 24 hours that would give me what a half a bitcoin so doesn't look like it's going to be really profitable at this at this pace that we're at especially if the difficulty goes up again but it's really interesting to get involved with so that's how I got it working I did want to give a big shout out to the guys at Bitcoin Rigs because they really helped me and I there's no way that I could have done it without having that stuff prepped. I would have spent I would have spent a good 30 to 90 days trying to learn the commands in Ubuntu 
and how to get them to work and I couldn't have written this so for those of you miners out there I know there's a lot of commands in here that uh, I don't really know what they mean yet but you could offer your opinion on it. I know it looks like he set the work size at 128 and the aggression at 8. Uh, there's some other stuff here. I don't know what it is. So I guess there's some settings that can be played around with. But overall, a pretty pretty fast start considering my relatively small amount of knowledge about Ubuntu. And it got up and working that fast. So it was pretty much just a day to get it up and working and knowing what I know now I could order another one of these rigs and I could have it set up and mining in about five minutes ten minutes so great site I really appreciate what they, they've done for me I have no connection with these guys whatsoever it's just a site I found I'm gonna give them a shout out and let them know that I covered it covered them in this video and that uh, they're really good for the novice and I just really appreciate it. So I'm up and mining. I'll let you know how many I've mined and what my pace is and uh, some other things. Thanks for everybody who helped and offered me pointers. Really appreciate it because, I, like I said, I'm new to this. And we'll talk to you next time.